What's up, Capricorn, and welcome to my channel. I hope all of my beautiful Capricorns out there are doing well. I want to say hello to my new subscribers, my new viewers, and my returning viewers, you guys. What it do? Welcome to my channel. All right, so this is going to be a twin flame reading. I've already shuffled and pulled some cards, you guys. So let's go ahead and get into this reading. So Capricorn, your twin sees you as the Queen of Cups, okay? The Queen of Cups is someone that's very nurturing, okay? She's connected to her feelings, very emotional. This Queen of Cups is also someone that's highly psychic, okay? Very intuitive. This is someone that people are very drawn to her. And I feel like, Capricorn, your twin was also very drawn to you as well, okay? And this is someone that also loves to take care of kids, loves to take care of people, and also someone that can throw down in the kitchen, okay? So this is just energy. So male, so man, you can be in this Queen of Cups energy as well, okay? Then we have this Queen of Wands, okay? This is this karmic that I feel like your twin was dealing with here, okay? So this queen of wands is someone, okay, so the queen of wands is known as someone that's outgoing, beautiful. You know, she commands the room when she walks in. Like, people are drawn to her as well. She's very independent. She's the boss, okay? But this karmic, this queen of wands in reverse, is someone that's very obnoxious, okay? This is like a Jezebel. If y'all know what a Jezebel is, it's a hoe, okay? Someone that get around. Okay, this is someone that's very bossy. They always need constant attention. So it's like your twin can't make a move without this karmic calling them, blowing them up, seeing where they're going, what time they're going to be back, all that. You know what I'm saying? This is someone that's very messy. They're going to talk around, talk about people behind their back. And this queen of wands can also be kind of violent, you know, because wands, you know, represents that passion, that fire energy, okay? So this queen of wands is very fiery, okay? And it's like this this queen of wands, she wants people to feel less than her, okay? Now, we know the queens, they sit up on their throne, but we ain't looking down at no damn body. You know what I'm saying? But this queen of wands is. So, I feel like, Capricorn, there needs to be some type of change. And your twin needed to go through some type of transformation. They needed to close out the cycle. They needed to end this relationship with this queen of wands with this death in reverse but guess what capricorn they did not that's why this death card is in reverse okay they're resisting this change they're resisting walking away from this queen of wands okay now your twin capricorn is in this king of cups energy now if you realize you guys we have the queen of cups and we have the king of cups okay so this is definitely your divine counterpart here okay so the King of Cups is someone, you know, that knows exactly what they want in a relationship. They someone that that can provide emotional stability. They're in tune with their feelings and they're not afraid to express themselves. But this King of Cups in reverse is someone that will, will manipulate you with their words, okay? So they'll say all the right things, Capricorn, to get whatever it is they want. You know, they'll even go as far as telling you they love you just to get whatever they want, which even could be sex, you guys, okay? This is someone that's not mature. This is also someone that can have drug addictions, can abuse alcohol, and this is someone that you cannot trust. You cannot trust this King of Cups, okay? So this is the energy that your twin is in, but I feel like, Capricorn, your twin is in this energy because they're dealing with this energy. They're dealing with the fucked up karma. I'm sorry. They're dealing with this karma. So, you know, whatever type of toxic energy you're around, their energy is going to rub off on you, right? So I feel like, Capricorn, this is your energy, okay? You're in this seven of wands energy you guys i feel like you set boundaries when it comes to your twin okay for some of you guys you're no longer even dealing with your twin you're not talking to him you're not communicating you're not doing none of that stuff okay you got tired of your twin playing games with you keeping you stuck keeping you in your head you got tired of crying over your twin so look how she looking she like uh-uh i'm not dealing with this no more i got this one in my hand and i'll bust your head with it if i need to okay so I feel like, meanwhile, while you're protecting yourself and setting boundaries, your twin is over here juggling. You know what I'm saying? They're indecisive. They don't know what they want to do. They want to walk away from this Queen of Wands, okay? I feel like they're getting tired of this Queen of Wands, or they're starting to see this Queen of Wands for who they really are. But yet and still, because possibly this is like a marriage or a relationship or someone that they've been with for a long time, it's hard for them to let go of this connection, okay? So I feel like Capricorn, whatever this situation is, Capricorn, this connection with your twin, whatever has went down, guess what? You're going to receive justice, okay? You see that sword here? You know sword talks about communication, okay? So you will receive justice. You're going to get the truth, okay, whether it comes from your twin or you finding out the truth in other means, a.k.a. a tarot card reader, a.k.a. me, okay? So let's pull... I want to pull from a couple cards. We're going to see 
if I can get them all out. Okay, so let's start here. We're going to see what's going on with your twin. This probably going to be a part two, you guys, because... I just feel like I got, I want to see what's going on with this karmic. Because we do know it's a karmic involved in this situation. Okay, so yes, this is going to be part two. We're going to probably pull here and this is going to be part two. Alright, so what messages do you have for my Capricorn spirit? Okay, so we have X. Look at, the, uh, X. Look at this. I just said that. Thank you, spirit, for that confirmation. Remember I just said, Capricorn, you're going to receive justice. I feel like your twin is juggling the decision of whether to break up with this karmic. You know what I'm saying? They're ready to stop the pattern. You know what I'm saying? They're, they're tired of feeling abandoned in this, in this connection. There ain't no love in this connection. You know, this. I feel like this. This your twin is dealing with this karmic only for a specific reason. Maybe because of kids or financial reasons or... You know, something to that nature. But your twin is up here juggling this situation or whether they need to walk away from this karmic or not. Give me some more messages from my Capricorn spirit. Okay, but some of you guys, you could be welcoming new love, okay? Meanwhile, on the ranch, while your twin kind of trying to figure out what the hell they going to do, you could be opening your heart to welcome new love, okay? You, it's like you're you tired of waiting, or some of you guys, maybe you've been trying to wait on your twin to make some type of decision. But I'm going to tell you something. We don't wait for nobody, baby, okay? Because something is going to happen. Look at this. We got the lightning, but this is in reverse, you guys. Okay, so there's supposed to be some type of sudden change. Okay, there's supposed to be some type of epiphany or transformation. Because we know this death card, this talks about transformation, but this is in reverse. Okay, so this is what your twin is resisting this change. Okay, they're resisting this transformation from moving on from this karmic. Okay. And it's still supposed to be some type of news or something. Maybe you were supposed to be finding out that your twin was supposed to be communicating to you. But they have not done that yet, okay? They have not went through this change. This person has not healed. They haven't done none of that. So you will receive justice, Capricorn. But it's going to be a minute, okay? Because your twin is not ready to make these changes yet, okay? And this is your twin flame, okay? For you guys is wondering whether I called out a sign or you seen a sign. What we got here? We got water, fire. Um, yeah, we got everybody here. Water, fire, earth, and air, okay? So, this is your twin flame, okay? And you guys will come into union. Your twin is going to find a way to balance this connection, okay? This card was also in reverse, but I'm just showing you the card, okay? So, this is your twin flame, you guys. But, like I said, your person's not ready to come in and balance this connection, okay? They're not ready to come into union just yet, Capricorn. That's all I have for you guys. If anything resonates, don't forget to like this video. I love you and stay blessed.